Welcome back to another video. Let's welcome back to another video. Alright guys, so make sure like, share, subscribe. So today guys, as you can see by the title below, y'all know what I'm gonna do today. So I'm gonna go to like 2010. Not 2010. Fun facts about me. Yeah, we're pretty sure it's probably like, if not the first video, we'll do the first intro. And I probably see that somebody may make a repeat anyways. But some things you probably you guys probably not you guys don't know about me. Hey guys, so guys don't forget to like, share, and subscribe because if you're not subscribed to me, you're really, you're really nasty on me, is it? Anyways guys, so let's get into the video. But before we get into the video, guys, I want to know why I'm really and truly never a post. And I know I want to be consistent and everything, but I am here and I, like, I cannot finish it because I'm going to have read. Anyways, guys, I haven't been consistent because I'm normally I use my phone, um, edit, and then the phone, you got disable. Like, man, if it's this thing with iPhones or whatever, but it's like the phone with this server for me, so I never have nothing to video with. And I recently bought a different phone. So, yeah, guys, I haven't been posting that because I'm using my phone video, I'm using my phone editing, like, legit use my phone, though. Every YouTube video, though. So, yeah, guys, I was out of my phone for a while. But, anyways, guys, let's get into the video because I'm going to get a phone now, so I'm going to continue to post. And, guys, don't forget, just like, share, subscribe, just bring the thing in. it. Anyways. Guys, 10 fun facts about me that y'all did not know. Okay, the first one. I'm not supposed to know why. I love reading, like, me read physical book, me read, like, online, what part. Me read, me read book all the time, all the other time, so that's me. Yes, I like reading. When you said that's not the first video, I'm going to do the first intro video. So yeah, I love to read guys. Like I'll read anything. Even magazine. I read magazine. <laughs> Funny enough, actually I just finished my novel. Um it's called Love at Lost Sight. So you're gonna need me pass love is blind and shit. But yeah. So anyways, yeah, I just finished that novel. I published it on Wattpad said upon Wattpad. This one, most of them I really like read or whatever, but as much as I love read, so yeah, just finished publish that and put my one part. Okay, so the other one, guys, number two, is that my future, my dream job is to be a lawyer and hopefully one one law firm, guys. Just moment, say me, I try, me try in every means to accomplish that. I'm no, I forget that. So yeah, I want to be a corporate lawyer. Like at first, me did I run on the fuck to be a criminal lawyer and then me I said criminal criminal law something. I mean, lawyer is challenging overall, but the criminal law one is like it's like you're asking people to come at you. Understand? Like you know, go walk in a piece. You have always a walk with your protection. You always a walk with something because, for instance, say you're a criminal lawyer and you represent. Say so yeah, I represent a bad man and yeah, you know say so you are into the crime but once your client say yo I never do this I can't go against the client words because once you go against the client words because them say I mean do it you know, but you know you tell them say I mean do it I never do it innocent yada 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 once you go against the client word you lose your license so say you go you go you go to represent that person there that the man the person will kill the person and you go represent them and then the jury say yo you're guilty and the man get a 35 to life the man people are going to come after you because the man say it was a good life and the ignorant people are going to say it was a good life so you have to always watch your back and to be honest corporate law is like it's more exciting to me because it's business law it's a lot of work but it's not as much work um as the criminal lawyer but yes yeah, so that's what i want to do i want to be a corporate lawyer i love I just love law. Everything with law. I think I watch my ID. I watch um, fatal attraction. Um, like all them some of the real stories. That's that's what I do. I just love like those type of stuff. Yeah, guys. And number three, this is like an illness that I I had. At, I think my bond with it or develop it over the years or whatever. But I have like severe migraine. For instance, if I don't drink water. For a day, then my migraine. My mom and me like it, but I think I'm like holy, like 
dizzy one for me them type of summer name. and it's so it's messed up because the migraine the, the super migraine that it's just it's awful i can't eat banana i can't eat, drink orange juice i can't eat orange if me if if me eat like if me wake up eight o'clock to make a bit o'clock in the morning and me eat like 12 o'clock them time me i gonna regret it for the entire day because i'm gonna eat on time i'm gonna suppose for myself hungry not you yeah at 30 minutes i'm supposed to hungry for 30 minutes else to come with that tragic migraine day take up it's awful it's really awful it's not something i would wish on my worst enemy because one time i'd actually um end up in a hospital because of my migraine it's not a nice thing because the doctor didn't even really know what happened because when i said migraine did this like i could sleep every minute they want to come and wake me up just in case anything you know pass it i'm asleep or whatever whatever the story of that i'm gonna tell no that good story for that other story of that go i'm gonna put that story time tell the home end up in the hospital let me just come from school and then yeah but me couldn't know that no that story time all right guys so number four number four um yeah i don't really like yeah yeah at one point in time we usually were like blue and black makeup like black lip gloss black eyeliner like everything in a black because i love black like i just and then when them look up band they usually look up but we usually get to school and them say oh let's be not supposed to wear that my hand did full man that's how i'm right as i come straight down here so with them yeah i'm right as i go straight down here so because it i mean you're not other color but black like so people usually say you're, you're just like an emo one one says different say you're gonna just like an emo and then we usually start listening to the music and stuff like that and then Marianne say oh them dark them deep them dark them dark them dark them dark it's like them cut them yeah so i wasn't gonna consider myself as an emo i just love black makeup black clothing everything that has to do right now i'm full black man you know yeah so yeah, I just love black. Some of the kinds of them stuff that you they just anything I put with black, me that. Any clothing in a black. Right now, if I forgot buying nothing, like all I'm just the majority of my just buy, just the me buy, I should say. But just that I buy alone black when I buy another color but black dress. But if I just, you know, that's colored, when I'm a mother, like, mother buy them for me, or my sister buy them for me, or whatever, whatever, but I don't wear any, I'm not buy any color but black dress. That's all. Alright, so number five. It, not really a social uh, social person like it happened since well, when we go Middlebrook when we start high school like we just at high school when I when I talk talk thing because when I was in primary school yeah Mr. Gajan is primary school by the way anyways when I was in primary school like I was like them that consider me as a you really say bully but maybe just low fight like me to get trouble them time that yet at that time and my friend i don't even know anybody with us like me see you and you even look at me a certain way me i go and fight you and me i go fight you that's just how i was so and then at one point it gets it like a talk my mother and then me i say oh me can't live like this because for witness sir i go through so much something because of me i could live like that so me just like say oh me not dealing with people that would make it better for me so would they just say all right then i'm not gonna do people maybe if we don't do people then would have to get myself in a trouble is it me i said mother would have forgot to certain something Blah. so yeah that's the reason why i'm gonna really talk to people and they look at socialized things honestly guys if i'm being a hundred percent honest instagram you guys don't follow me on instagram so please don't follow me on but Instagram, no, I never, I like, never go on Instagram and too much, like, my little brother and sister did the point and I realized, like, oh, it's a bit fun. Yeah, you know, yeah, scroll and I watch people's videos and stuff like that, so, yeah. Yeah, I'm not, really. Even if, right now, if we're going on, if it's that we're going on a trip with beaches and stuff like me, I go enjoy myself. Like, I'm a vibesy person, but so it's like if you see and just come to you and talk to you or if you see me and just come to me and it's not say they're gonna get the vibe like i don't want to talk but it's not that it's just how i am or my brought myself to be because one time i say 
Now we want to talk to people because people understand me. So I'm going to talk to people understand me. Now I get me and say, I'm going to do something if you don't understand it. Again, that, that, that was the whole, that's how me did see. That was my point of view. But yeah, I'm very vibes, you guys. If you go somewhere, vibes, even if you don't know you, I have to bring the vibes. I can't go away with it. I'm going to like it. But if you go to you and just talk to you, and I mean that. Mm -mm. Not going to work. Yeah, guys, so number six now, number six. Yeah, I think this is many of everybody but me know what I mean. Like I'd rather be rich than famous. As most of them really socialize with people, so not being famous is not a problem, but having the cash, yeah. I'd rather be like more that rich rich and nobody know what I mean. Mm -hmm. I say that's how I feel. This is definitely how I feel like nobody, those family, friends, rather rich and in the whole world know me. That's how I pray life. As me, when I've explained, like, I'm just my previous just explained, I'm gonna really socialize with people. And even though famous people are really socialize with in support as are anything. But yeah, I'm rather rich than famous. And nobody else, that's just that's just me. Just moi. That's just me. And if it's me, I look very so I'm one book married to as I'm saying video my phone means video so I could have my phones and I use the book for my Alright, so I already established I just said I love black and where oddly enough pink is my favorite color. Like people would ask me and say you don't look like a person with a will love pink. You look like a person that does love black or red because you know them color have those good dark well black is dark but you know red have this little I don't know what to call it but this little thing to it. They see it but I love pink. Like if I go somewhere and me buy like some for instance me buy a cup. It's a fina pink, my toothbrush a fina pink. Like, if I buy a tablecloth, it's a fina pink. If I buy a bottle of lotion, it's a, it, it just half a pink. I just, I don't know, I just love pink. But when it comes to black, I'll do any, anything in black. So, yeah. Um, and you know, like, some person that said they're allergic to certain things, this would be number one. I don't know, you know, which number one, but anyways. Like, some persons that I say, um, I'm allergic to food, I'm allergic to seafood and peanuts and stuff like that. I'm not allergic to any type of food. Medicine, maybe. Like, I'm allergic to cetamol, cetamol migraine. The other day I took it, guys, and let me tell you. Because I must say, severe migraine, I mean, me got a pharmacy, you know, I said, I'm going to get some pills for my migraine. I normally take like Advil until then when I get used to them get used to my body or whatever it just stop work from migraine. So I'm sorry then I take Panadol but when I take the Panadol it well the Panadol works but it take like say an hour and you know you take a pill and you, you hope it work immediately no I work immediately after you just wait 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 anyways I got the pharmacy I'm going to see this set set them all migraine so I'm say finally they make a pill say migraine right you might not still got the pill. Evening. Even with the pill, I feel like, you know, you're gonna you ever eat edibles like, like cookie, you ever eat cookie yet? Like, as someone did feel. I mean, so why the hell I feel like this? Anyways, the next morning when I woke up, I woke up with some swelling on my skin. Like, some horrible swelling. And I mean, I found like my fan is so hard for breathe at one point I could have taste blood in my chest. It did just it is just awful. Awful bad. I mean my eyes swell, my ears swell, my chest like legit every part of me did just swell up. It's just awful. So yeah, that's the only thing I know myself that is allergic to just the the set of my migraine set of that's all. So I'm allergic to I'm allergic to food and I am happy for that. I can't name me anything. Yeah, I'm just happy for that. Um, yeah, and the other one, I think this is number nine. Um, of course, you no, know, no, I was born in October. So this is 22 October coming. Yeah, guys, so born in October, that's a, a fun fact. And the last one, of course, is I don't think y'all knew this, but. I was born a twin. Yeah, I had a twin brother. But he died at childbirth. So 
Anyways, so yeah, I, I was born a twin. As in some I really know him. And that's how I'm gonna get my last Megal name, I should say. Because it's like, you know, when you have a twin, you name them similar to something. Like, for instance, you have Jane and the girl that named Jane, the boy that named Zane or something. <laughs> but yeah, so me, because my twin died, um, then just give him first name as a Megal name. And it's very ridiculous, guys. I'm not going to tell you what it is, but it is, it's ridiculous. But anyways, people always said to me, so like, if you don't like it, why not change it? I mean, I said, oh, why would I change it? As in, if I don't like it, I'm going to change it because they use it to say, oh, I'm a twin brother. They don't even give me a name. So he's like, basically, still a part of me. So I'm going to want, if I don't really like it, I'm going to change it. That's it. So, yeah, guys. All right, so that was 10 fun facts about me guys don't forget to just comment down below some videos and mama and mama see me do and then me definitely do it guys like me legit do it but anyways guys that's the end of the video so do enjoy the rest of the video today don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see you in another video and guys don't forget to follow on instagram i'm gonna leave it up on the screen so do don't and so just run go by there just go follow me because you need just name me but anyways guys so don't forget to like share and subscribe don't forget to leave a comment and don't forget to press the like button. Yeah, guys, I don't know, subscribe and just turn the push notification. You see me? Because I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. a couple years from now, I'm going to look at video and it's going to cringe me out. I'm going to be a part of it and say, yeah, I did it for that. You see it? So, yeah, guys. So, anyways, let's see you in another video. Bye-bye.